we are here in solving question number eight of the WASI 2023 Core Mathematics of Deck Paper 2. Given that y equal x root t squared plus u, make t the subject of the relation. If y equal 12.2, x equal 0 0.02, and u equal 1.1, evaluate correct to the nearest whole number, the value of t. So the previous videos are also found in the same playlist. You can just check the playlist to find all the other videos, the previous ones. Okay, thank you. Now we have the solution. We are to make y the we are, we are to make t the subject of y equal x root t squared plus u. Okay, so the first thing we are going to do is to divide both sides by x, by x. So if that is the case, this to cancel this, we are left with y over x here. Y over x is equal to square root of t squared plus u. So what do we do next? Yes, we square both sides. We got it right. So this will take, get rid of that. And we have y squared over x squared over here is equal to t squared plus u. Now what do we do next? Good. We make t squared a subject. So t squared will be equal to y squared. I'm just swapping it. I have not changing it. I'm sending the u to this side to become negative. So y squared over x squared minus u. So if that is the case, we can call it LCM on the left on the right hand side to get y squared minus u x squared over x squared. So t squared is equal to that. So you can take square root of both sides to get t equal plus or minus square root of y squared minus u x squared over x squared so you can split the you can split the square root for them to get t equal plus or minus square root of y squared minus u x squared all over x so you can do it like that you can leave it like this where x is not equal to zero so the b part let's look at the bii so this is the the aii so let's look at the aii 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 part is here so we are substituting the values y equal 12.2 x equals 0 0.02 and 1.1 so we substitute and simplify as you can see and that will give us plus or minus 610 to the nearest whole number that is what we are asked to do let's move straight to the b part a school offers piano and flute lessons to a group of 50 children of these children 28 attend piano lessons 17 attend flute lessons and 12 attend neither piano nor flute lessons illustrate the information in a venn diagram find the number of children who attend only piano lessons so let's start. So we can draw a Venn diagram like this. The inversor set and illustrate it. Piano for P, flute for F. And we're told that 12 attend neither piano nor flute. So it will be here. Now we don't know the number who offer both. So we represent it with X. Then this will be only piano, 28 minus x. So to find that, we need to solve for the value of x and subtract it from 28 to get only piano lessons. So we add everything, this, 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 and equate it to 50. So when we simplify, we get 57 minus x equal 50. So x will be equal to 7. So number who attend only piano lesson will be 
28 minus 7, which is 21 children. So let's move straight to question number 9. Please don't go. Thank you. Thank you. See you in the next video. Don't forget to subscribe to this channel. Thank you for doing that. And also you can follow us here.